least that bird's having fun out there, the old bald eagle. <laughs> that was random. Anyways, what's up guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408. Mr. Freeman, how are you? Good, excellent. It's very, been very a rainy bright. day here. Very, it's very bright today. <laughs> Look at that. And it's warm. It's uh, a little bit cold. He's the only person I can talk to to go out and film in the rain. So we're going to have some fun today real quick. Maybe go chase down that bald eagle that flew by. We got the new rig, as you can see. And we haven't been in the Maverick since the old Easter ride. I don't know if you guys have watched that video, but as you can see, I have not washed it. So I do have new tires for it. And um, I completely forgot about those. So I'm like, let's burn off these old tires. So we're gonna head down the track, try not to get you too muddy or the new truck, but we'll see. And uh, yeah, then maybe we'll whip some, uh, whip some shitties with this thing. So. Let's uh, let's go play in the rain. Let's do it, Mark. <laughs> oh, what a beautiful day, folks! Beautiful day indeed. Mud City. I don't think I got this thing set on super wide angle. I need to change those settings. Yeah, this thing has not been washed in a while. Still, only got 317 kilometers on it. Why isn't the gate opening? Open sesame. Come here. Come here. There we go. Don't take out the gate. I have hit it before in the golf cart going pretty quick and it hurt. Dead stop, right in the face. All right, go for it, Mark. Gotta make sure she's warmed up. I have water pouring down my boot. I don't know where it's coming from. What? Look. Well, I see water right here. Oh. Here it is coming off the roof. All right, let's see how muddy we can get. Go for it. Good. Two wheel drive gets you muddy. Four wheel drive with diff lock, that's a whole whole different story. I think I'm gonna have to drive up the road real fast to let the uh, rain wash off the mud. And you're gonna have to get the power washer out here too, Mark. Yeah, maybe I'll just leave it out in the rain all night. <laughs> gonna keep on going. All right, let's uh, let's tour down to one of those cars real quick and see if I can back up on it and do a burnout. Okay. <laughs> it's not getting any warmer outside. We still have the fusion. I don't know why, but. Uh, delete these headlights off here. No one needs headlights. If anyone needs some fusion headlights, they're in the Chevy Civic here. So my plan is to back up on top of it. I don't know, I've never tried it before, and then try and do a burnout on the hood. This thing is a lot wider than my last machine, so let's see how it goes. Okay, and you're wearing your seatbelt. Yeah, I got my seatbelt. So on. if you flip it over, it's okay. Yeah, well, I'm uh, not going to be doing mock chicken. I'm going to do it very slowly. So. All right, well, let's see what you're going to do, Mark. Uh, 
What's that? I think my hitch is eating. Your hitch is eating? <laughs> my hitch is eating. All right, I'll turn around and try on the front. Yeah, I don't think she's tall enough. I think it wants to push it. It doesn't want to climb on top, Mark. All right. Little big shift ramp press. Let's do it. You gotta get off on top somehow. Is that high enough or a little higher? Well, let's give it a try and see. I need to go a little higher. Okay. That should do the job. That's off of uh, previous experiments. I couldn't even tell you which car. <laughs> Round two. Okay. Like I said, I need a backup camera. Maybe one of your sponsors will send you one, Mark. <laughs> yeah, maybe. There you go. Look at that. Good stuff. Oh, I thought you said wow. No. Get some momentum. Woo! There we go. There you go. That's what you wanted. All right. I, I guess we're going to have to do a reverse burnout. Give it a try. Ah, uh, there goes the windshield. <laughs> We're falling off. Right now, you're uh, you're on two wheels, Mark. One back wheel and one front wheel. Trying to get rid of those tires. Yeah, they make new tires every day. Okay. Pretty good. How are you gonna get off of here, Mark? Once you get down to the rims, you'll get some traction. 
I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get down. We might have a situation. The problem is you got only uh, two tires hitting the uh, ground in the car there, Mark. What am I caught on? Uh, you just hung up somehow. Oh, I didn't yeah. have the dip lock on. Okay. There you go. That's the ticket. Oh, look at that windshield over there. Oh man. Still smoking. Oh. So technically that was half a tire burnout. I don't think the other tire was even touching. No, it was off the car. Woo. We'll go uh, grab a can of water and fill that full, but it looks like I burned right through the window. No kidding. I don't know what the heck I was caught on. It was just kind of hung up there, Mark. Oh yeah, only one of the bars is caught on here. Yeah, look at all the scratching right there, see? Yeah. Oh, good though. Right there. Yeah. Cracked the hood pretty good. What is that, fiberglass or is it actually metal? I don't know. It's like a plastic paint. Yeah, it's like a coating or something. Three layers, look at that. Gray, white, and black. All right, let's head back up to the farm. We'll go whip the cities and uh, wrap this one up for the day. Mark, what's going on inside the car here? I think we got a little Cheech and Chong action going on in here. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my God. Woo. <laughs> oh, I can smell the tires. Oh, she's locked. It's locked. It's gonna take a minute to clear out. I guess all the smoke shot inside. Oh, batteries don't work, right? Oh. Wow, look at that. And it stinks. Woo. Good thing it's a windy day here. Good thing it's a brand new pre-owned car. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's roll up. And just like that, we are done. That was random. I wanted to try something different. A little burnout on the old Maverick. Get the belt nice and hot. Thought the belt was going to explode for sure. I was doing 140 uh, kilometer an hour burnout there. And then the cyclones. I don't know where those cyclones were. I think that was somewhere in Mexico. But uh, the diff lock, let me tell you, that's absolutely insane for cyclones. Holy, I was getting dizzy quick. But yeah, that thing's so wide and... The Fox shocks with the smart shocks on it, insane for uh, Cyclone Donuts. I suggest doing it on um, when it's wet or on ice because, yeah, you wouldn't want to do that on dry pavement, that's for sure. Anyways, have a fantastic day. Hope you enjoyed the video. Check out the links below. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Pick up some merch, su support the team, and go follow the Eagle. We'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.